God bless you. For my sin, God bless you wherever you are joining us from. Please begin to share this broadcast right now. We have a few minutes. We are going to pray some prayers. We are going to be speaking into our hands. I pray that God give us the time to be able to pray some of the few prayers we are going to pray wherever you are. Begin to share this broadcast. Invite your friends, your loved ones. Let them join. Wherever you are, distance is not a barrier. The hand of God will touch you in the name of Jesus. Begin to share right away. Begin to invite friends or loved ones. God bless you are those there. Let me know those who are there, where you are joining us from. Let me know those who are there today. God bless you all. God bless you all. God bless you. God bless you. Chiwe, my daughter, God bless you. Isioma, happy Easter. God bless you. Let me know where you are joining us from. Yes, it's very important to us. Tell us where you are joining us from. God bless all of you. I hope you are sharing um, what you need to do. Maybe you join us, you begin to share right away. As you are joining us, begin to share with friends and loved ones. Remind those who told that um, there shall be prayers today. Wherever they are, let them join us. Begin to share the broadcast. Begin to share right away, wherever you are. Distance is not a barrier. God bless you. Jay Sinta. Jay Sinta, how are you? Good morning to you also. Helen, God bless you. Is this Helen in, in Calabar? God bless all of you, wherever you are joining us from. I'm going to pray with you. I'm going to be praying for you. We are speaking into our hands. Your hands is the symbol of your labor, your symbol of your wealth, the symbol of your prosperity. One day, hands is under attack. Everything that has to do with the prosperity of the person will be under threat. Today, we are going to be praying briefly this morning. For a few minutes, we are going to be speaking to our hands wherever you are. I will decree upon your hands and your hands will be able to grab whatever that has been responsible for inability to hold too long. That yoke shall be broken. The cross will be dismantled in the name of Jesus. God bless all of you. Aleru Aoudou, you join from Suleja in Niger State. God bless you. Nzezi, you are joining from, from South Africa, Port Lisbeth in South Africa. God bless you. Cynthia, God bless you. Good morning. Okay, Helen, how are you? How is... Um, Calabar, God bless you. Please begin to share right now. You belong to a lot of platforms and begin to share to to, to inform people to be part of this uh, broadcast. God bless you. God bless you. God bless you wherever you are joining us from. So we are going to be talking about the deliverance of the hands. I'm going to be praying a few prayers. 21 here about uh, concerning your hands. Uh, this will be the part one of it if time will not permit us to retool with everything that we're going to do this morning. God bless you once again. God bless you. You're going to share. You're going to share. Invite your friends, your loved ones. Send to people through Messenger. Share in all the platforms. And begin to, um, to let them know that you are watching. Ada, how are you, Vera? Good morning. God bless you. God bless all of you. God bless all of you this morning. This is the morning the Lord has made and I strongly believe that God has a word for somebody. The word of God carries the wonders that you will be believing God for. It's going to come this morning. Signs and wonder is going to come because God's word is the carrier of God's power. And God's power will give faith to testimonies. God's power, nothing can stand against the word of God. The word of God is God himself. God is backed by every word that he has spoken. He said, my word will not leave me and return unto me void until he fulfilled that which he sent forth to do. 
But the word of God is going to be saying for this morning and is to do. Is to do something in your life, is to do something in your body, to do something in your finance, to change your name, to remove the reproach, to remove mockery. And that is why the word of God is coming to somebody this morning. Wherever you are joining from, I'm going to be praying for you under this platform. I'm going to be praying for you. I'm going to be speaking into your destiny. Distance is not a barrier. Distance is not a barrier. Distance is not a barrier. Wherever you are, I'm going to be talking to your hands. Your hands is the symbol of the labor. Your hands signifies your prosperity, your wealth. Your hands talks about the ability to gather. Your hands is the symbol of being a blessing. So that shall be a blessing in the land. It shall be a blessing in the field. In the going out and the coming in, thou shalt be blessed. That is what is written of you. That is uh, 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 written your divine birth certificate by heaven. God wants to prosper you. God wants to bless you. A man that do not have money, don't have a voice. You are voiceless when there is scarcity. And it's not the agenda of God. The Lord is your shepherd. Thou shalt not want. You shall not lack. That is the covenant promises of God. The thou shalt be like the tree planted by the riverside of plenty of waters. Thou shalt be like the tree planted by the rivers of, of waters. And then you flourish. That is the agenda of God for your destiny. 2019 is our year of supernatural ease and double honor. It takes, it takes the hand of God for honor to come. The anointing of ease is what brings common prosperity brings open heaven over your life and this morning we shall be talking to your hands your hands is going to receive deliverance the hands can be tied the hands can be caged the hands can be bewitched the hands can be manipulated by the enemies begin to share the broadcast wherever you are joining from begin to share amongst your friends and loved ones let them know that you are watching let them know that you are here please let me know where you are joining us from god bless you you are welcome you are welcome you are welcome We've got few minutes we are going to spend in this prayer. So we have about 21 prayers we are going to pray. And wherever you are, you pray about to decree and declare those prayers. The heavens are put your hand is going to be open. And every chain and every center, and the enemies are placed upon your hands, they are going to be broken. Your hands, they have the ability to gather. Your hands talks about the ability to be. Your hands is the world is responsible for death and keep. But the devil is bombarding, attacking too many hands. They grasp and they lose. They get, they lose. So this morning, briefly, we are going to be praying, talking to our hands. We are going to talk to your hands wherever you are. Distance is not a barrier. And that is what God wants us to do this morning. God bless you. Joy. So if you are aware, you join us from. Please let us know that you are watching. God bless some of you. Begin to share the broadcast. Begin to share the broadcast. Begin to share right away. Invite somebody to join you. Invite somebody to join you. Call a friend. Send to people uh, via messenger. They'll get it and they'll be on with us in this platform. Stella, God bless you. You're watching from Masarawa. God bless you. God bless you wherever you are. You are all welcome in Jesus' name. You're welcome in the name of Jesus. This does not a barrier. God bless you. God bless you. God bless all of you. Really. God bless you. God bless you. God bless you. The hand. The devil has an agenda against the hand. The devil wants the hands to remain in the valley. The devil wants so many hands to be caged, to be tied. So many hands are moving, but spiritually has been caged. So many hands, the devil has attacked the hands with spiritual leprosy. Nothing stays in that hand. Evil basket has been placed in so many hands. They labor like elephants, the cannibal gets an ant portion. It is a cause and is a taboo, it's an error. The hands of so many people have been bombarded by the devil. A lot of people don't own their hands, but the devil is controlling it. The enemies determine what comes in there and what is not there. And that is why you see that a lot of people cannot account for what they labor for. Today that yoke is going to be broken. The curse is going to be broken. The jeans, the spare will be lifted in the name of Jesus. Today, today is your day of deliverance. Your hands is going to receive deliverance. Your hands is going to be liberated. Your hands is going to be set free. In the name of Jesus. And once that happens, the expectation.
expected, the long expected breakthrough would manifest in the name of Jesus. But don't forget that. Oh, my daughter Victoria, God bless you, Victoria. Please share the broadcast um, and tell us where you are joining us from. Share the broadcast as well and tell us where you're joining us from. So today we are talking, we are speaking uh, uh, upon our hands. Your hands need to be liberated. And that of us, my beloved daughter, God bless you. God bless you. I guess you're not watching alone, you're watching with uh, um, Alice the Great. Quickly, in the book of Proverbs, let's look at what the book of Proverbs says. I'm going to look at the book of Proverbs in the book of Proverbs. In the Old Testament, Proverbs chapter 12. Proverbs chapter 12, verse 24. The hand of the diligent shall be a rule, but the slothful shall, shall be under tribute. God speaks about the hands in the scripture. That the hands can be slothful. What is making the hands to be slothful? Nobody desires that his or her hands will be slothful. It is the manipulation of the devil. It is the manipulation of the devil. Look at what verse 11 said in the same book of Proverbs, verse 11. Proverbs chapter 12, verse 11 now says. He that tilleth the land shall be satisfied with bread. But he that followeth vain persons is void of understanding. He that tilleth. So it takes the hand to walk. So the hand is a symbol of your labor. The hand is a symbol of your prosperity. The hand is a symbol of your work. The hand is a symbol of your achievement. The hand is a symbol of your promotion. The hand is a symbol of your success. The hand is a symbol of your elevation in life. The hand determines what comes in. The hand talks about your greatness. With the hands you are able to gather. With the hands you are able to grasp. With the hands you are able to hold for. With the hands you are able to present. With the hands you are able to become a blessing to others. I pray for you this morning. We are going to be praying. We have 21 prayers. We are going to pray. Whatever that is responsible, whatever attack has been launched against your hands, that attack is going to die in the name of Jesus. And that is why you see people, they will write exam, they will fail over and over. And that is why you see that a lot of people, they will venture into, into business. That business will go down the drain. That business will not succeed. Others will succeed in that same business, but when it comes to them, it will be unmovable. They don't succeed. Something is wrong somewhere. Something is wrong somewhere. Whatever they tend to lay that hands to do, it does not work. They'll try what others have done before, it's not going to work. Sheu, God bless you, my beloved. God bless you. You join in. Sheu, try and see if Papa can join us. Oh, God bless you, my beloved. God bless you. Thank you for that information. 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 Lillian, God bless you. God bless all of you. Please begin to share. Begin to share. We are speaking into our hands. I have 21 prayers. I'm going to pray upon your hands. Whatever the enemies have been doing, whatever the devourer has eaten, there shall be restoration. Whatever attack has prospered against your hand is going to backfire. The hands can be under a curse. The hands can be under a gist. The hands can be under a spare. The hands can be caged. The hands can be buried. The hands can be tied. The hands can be bewitched. The hands can be oppressed. The hands can be manipulated. They can be injected. The hands can be paralyzed. The hands can be sick. The hands can be arrested. 
The devil can do a lot of things to the hands of a man. The hands can be under witchcraft manipulation. And once all these things happen, a lot of things will begin to go wrong. I have to be very fast because we need to pray those prayers. They are very, very important. The attack against the hands can come from anywhere. The, hands, the attack against the hands can come from your ex. I'm not going to marry you again. And he will say, well, okay, no problem. Now you say you will not marry me. Whatever you lay your hands to do, you will not prosper. You shall not excel. The cause upon the Rubenite was the cause that says they, they shall not excel. And that cause prospers in the labor of the hands of the Rubenite. Whatever they lay their hands to do, they will not prosper. And that is why you see a lot of people, location does not matter. It does not matter. They change location. They move from one city to another city. The same thing will follow them. Whatever they lay their hands to do, it does not work. And now they are blaming the woman they got married to. And now they are blaming the man they got married to. Anything they tend to do with their hands, it will go wrong. This morning is deliverance of the hands. I'm speaking into your hands. I don't know the basket the enemies have given to you. I don't know the exchange that has taken place with your hands. The hands can be exchanged by the enemies. And that is why you see the person will try this, will try this, yet the person will fail. If your hands has been exchanged this morning, as I pray by the power in the word of God, the exchange shall be reversed. If your hands has been given to another person, you are from a polygamous home, your stepmother has took your hands and gave it to the, to the son. That one is a selling. You are not begging and living at the mercy of your younger uh, brother that you uh, that is that you know uh, of, of the same father with you. This morning, that polygamous wickedness shall come to an end. The Bible said, "Let the wickedness of the wicked come to an end." So, a lot of hands that the people are carrying about, it's not their hands. It's not their hands. Their hands has been exchanged. So, I don't know who has changed your hands. I don't know what the enemies have done against your hands. We are going to pray. Your hands is going to receive deliverance. The hand of God is going to be upon your hands today. And the yoke shall be broken. The jeans shall be lifted. The spare will be destroyed. In the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. Once the hand is under attack, whatever you lay the hands to do will be infested. Whatever you lay the hands to do, that thing will be corrupted. They give the person 10 million today before you know. In no distant time, the person will be go begging, borrowing. The hands of the young man they called the prodigal son was under attack. Everything the father gave to him, they were wasted. The Bible said everything went the righteous way. There is nothing he could account for in no this time. And that is why you see some people, you just give them penny, and that penny will grow into millions. And some, they toss this, it will not work. They lay their hands to do this, it will not work. They keep moving from place to place. They become mockery of their friends and their loved ones. People are tired of seeing them the way they are. I don't know whatever is responsible. It could be your father, it could be your mother, whoever it is. An enemy is not a stranger. Whoever that has placed a curse upon your hands that say whatever you lay these hands to do will not prosper. Once the hand is cursed, beloved, it can affect everything in the, in the, in the life of the person. Once the hands is cursed, it can result to barrenness. And they say with your hands you cannot carry your baby. It then means that you are going to be barren. It's a multiple curse. When the hands is covenanted to failure, beloved, distance is not a barrier. Let the person leave the father's house, go to city. The same battle will continue. The battle of inability to grab for long. The battle, the, the battle of get and lose. The battle of failure at the edge of breakthrough. The battle of inability to keep good relationship will begin to bombard the destiny of the person. Enough is enough. The devil is a liar. For a few minutes, we have about 21 prayers we are going to pray. Begin to share this broadcast right now. Somebody will be happy that you connected him or her to this platform. Just begin to share right now. We are going to the prayers and I will be, as we begin to pray. Pray wherever you are. Repeat the prayer after me. And as you repeat the prayer after me, the power of God, the anointing of God will begin to walk in your life. The yoke will be broken. Don't forget Jesus said, the word I speak, they are spirit and life. It means there is spirit behind every spoken word of God. That you've received this morning and then change is going to come in the name of jesus i don't care how long the enemy has done it but one thing is important is this they've done enough enough is enough you are going to speak to your hands i will not remain in this spot my hands this is the time the season for you to be favored by zion my hands receive the favor of god and every prayer that shall come today 
shall give birth to testimonies in your life if you dare to believe them and if you dare to receive it. The hand of God is ready to be opened as you open your mouth. The hand of God is ready to be opened as you open your mouth. What is expected of you is to open your mouth. A open mouth will give birth to open heaven. Once the mouth is closed, the devil will succeed in closing your doors. The devil will succeed in turning things against you. So this morning, be ready. Get ready. Begin to share this broadcast. Invite your friends, your loved ones. Let me know where you are joining us from. Now listen. The Bible told us in the book of Luke chapter 5 that Peter had told all night and Jesus came to the scene. And Jesus said, Peter, you need to hear the word of God because the word of God is a carrier of mercy. The word of God carries solution. And when Jesus was done teaching, the Bible said when Jesus was done teaching, he told Peter, you're going to launch your net. Things will change now. I don't know how long you've been in that condition. The word of God is coming. Just believe. If you believe, you will testify like others. The platform is full of testimonies of people that receive the word of God by faith. That believe their solution is in the hands of God, not in the hands of men. That believe in the power of prayer and things turn around for them. It is your turn now in the name of Jesus. The Bible said in the book of Esther, chapter 2, verse, 4, um, verse 14 and 15, that when it became the turn of Esther, things turn around. I know that this morning is your turn, and that is why God is giving you the grace to be on with us this morning. As it, it is your turn, God will turn this around for you. In the name of Jesus, God is going to turn this around for you. In the name of Jesus, the new week we are about to enter is going to be your week of favor. You are indebted. God is giving you the miracle of cancel death. In the name of Jesus, God is going to give you the miracle of cancel death. In the name of Jesus, you'll be believing God for job. God is going to perfect it for you in the name of Jesus. The job that is coming to you, even what the job you're not qualified for, the job that your qualify, qualification is not ready and yet to be accepted. It is only God that can do the impossible. And I strongly believe that it is your turn for God to remember. And God shall remember you in the name of Jesus. Wherever you are, I can see you joining us. Begin to share this broadcast. Begin to share the broadcast. Begin to invite friends, your loved ones. Wherever they are, distance is not a barrier. Distance is not a barrier. Peter told Jesus, I have told all night and I have caught nothing. Nothing to show for the labor of my hands. Whatever my hands touch, it dies. Whatever I lay my hands to do does not work. Even the certificate. Can't, I can't get anything with it. Why? Because the hand is in trouble. The hand is under attack. The hand needs deliverance. The hand needs freedom from the manipulation of the enemies. And that is why we've come this morning to pray with you. Get ready. We have about 21 prayers to pray. In the name of Jesus that cause is going to be broken. That cause is going to be broken. In the name of Jesus. I'm bringing the blessings of God upon you this morning. I'm bringing the blessings of God upon you this morning. Every cause that is working against your hands is going to be broken. I'm so excited because I see the rain of blessings. I see employment coming. I see when you have been rejected, you will be accepted. I see what you have lost, you retain it in back. I see restoration coming. I see financial resurrection. In the name of Jesus, the miracle of cancel debt is coming the way of somebody now. I see multiple appointments. I see promotion coming. In the name of Jesus, God has not forgotten you. Concerning your document, good news is coming. Concerning your document, good news is coming. Concerning your document, good news is coming. Concerning where you have applied before, good news is coming. Where you've been rejected, good news is coming. In the name of Jesus, your hands is going to be blessed. Your hands is going to be blessed. The songwriter says, my hands are blessed with the blessings of the Lord. My hands are blessed with the blessings of the Lord. My hands are blessed with the blessings of the Lord. Today, your hands are going to be blessed. Your hands are going to be blessed. God bless you, Abby, my daughter. Begin to share this broadcast. All the groups you belong to, begin to share now. All the groups they've added you to on, on online, begin to share right now. Begin to share among friends, send to them a messenger. Let them join immediately. We'll begin to pray the 21 prayers. Distance is not a barrier. I'm going to pray. This year, your hand will, your hand 
we handle, we hold your marriage certificate. It takes the hand to receive it. It takes the hand to receive it from the man of God that shall be presenting it to you. Yes, if the marriage certificate is not given to you, whether at the registry, whether in the church, it takes the hand to get it. And that is why we are praying upon your hands. Your hands is going to receive deliverance. Not only your labor. Your hands will carry your baby. Your hands will handle good things. Your hands will receive the good news. The letter. In the name of Jesus. With your hands you will receive that call of favor. With your hands you will receive that call of open heaven. In the name of Jesus. Begin to share. Robosa. Begin to share. Doris. Cynthia. Begin to share right away. I can see all of you. Wherever you are joining from. I'm going to pray for you. I'm going to pray for you. It's going to be from hands to hands. From hands to hands. I'm going to speak to the hands that are holding your blessings. They shall vomit it into your hands. Your hands shall grab it. It's going to be from hands to hands. From hands to hands. What a revelation. It is going to be released from the hands that has been holding it. Be the hand of Pharaoh. That has been holding the letter of your promotion. The letter of your testimonies. It's going to be released. It's going to be from one hand to another hand. I don't care the hands that is holding it. Whatever you be believing God for. It is the hand of Pharaoh. Is it the hand of your, of your, of your, of your the evil powers of your father's house? The hand of polygamous wickedness? The hands of household witchcraft? The hands of a friendly friend? The hands of the wicked shall release whatever they be holding. Whatever they've taken from you, they shall return it back. The Bible said, if a thief is caught and whatever it has taken, they've taken, whatever they've gotten from you, whatever they've stolen, they shall return in sevenfold. Where the others are coming from is not what we are interested in. That is the word of God. The Lord said they shall return it. And so shall it be. In the name of Jesus. Whatever the enemies have taken from you, beat your peace. Your hands is going to grab it. Is it marital peace? Your hands will get it. Is it your conception? You are receiving it. Is it your marriage? You are receiving it. In the name of Jesus. Whatever the enemy took from you, you shall get it back. You shall get it back. In the name of Jesus, they've, take, they've taken your document. They've stolen your document. And that is why you are struggling. It is difficult for you to get it. What others will get at ease, you can't get it. The devil is a liar. The curse is broken this morning. And you are taking the blessing. In the name of Jesus, wherever you are, where you've been rejected, you shall be accepted. Where you've been told, better luck next time. When you've been told, no way, you are going to be receiving a congratulatory handshake. And they will be saying, congratulations. And they will be saying, we are sorry. They will be saying, oh, receive our apology. In the name of Jesus, by the virtue of this broadcast, every closed doors, that doors are going to be opened. The same hands that close the doors, I command them to open it. I command them to open it. In the north, open it. In the south, open it. In the west, open it. That door they've closed against your mother's children. That door that has been shut, I command that power that shut the door to shut up. Open the door and die. In the name of Jesus, open the door and die. Every good doors that the hands have closed. It takes the hands to close the door. And it takes the hands to close it. You can't open the door with your mouth. You can't open the door with your legs. It is the hand that opens the door. And therefore, that's why I say it is hand to hands. The hands of your father's house. The hands of the family idol. The hands of familiar spirit. The hands of the spirit husband. The hands of witchcraft. The hands of occultic power. The hands of family strongman. Whatever they have taken from you, they are returning it. 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 Receive it now. 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 In the name of Jesus. Please begin to share this broadcast. Invite your friends, your loved ones. Share with your friends. Send to them through messenger. Send to all of them wherever they are. I decree upon your life. They took your marriage. They are returning it back. Your peace is returning. Your joy is returning. In the name of Jesus, whatever they've stolen from you, you are getting it back. You'll not be able to settle down. You'll find it difficult to settle down. They've taken your marriage certificate. They've stolen it. Today, the same man that took it, they shall return it. Whether in the water, whether in your village, whether in your compound, whether in your father's house, whether in the family compound, wherever it is, whether paternal or matana, whatever the enemies have taken from you, they took it by their hands, they are returning it in the name of Jesus. They are returning it. Whatever they stole from you, receive it now. 
receive it now receive it now receive it now any hands that is holding your academies they say you will start but you will not finish any hands that is catching what you are gathering you gather they scatter from year to year you are getting old things are not being fixed you are ashamed to see your younger ones or your friends you are hiding you are crying secretly you are soaking the pillow in tears your hands can't carry your baby because somebody said no because somebody has issued a decree because somebody has vowed i pray for you today what is hands to hands as i said before whatever they've taken that hands they've returned it in the name of jesus and therefore i pray for you every hand that has been stealing from you i command the hands to wither 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 whether the hands they are from your village they are from your father's house jesus said a man's enemies are the members of his own household wherever they might be whether they are friends I command those hands to return what belongs to you and I command the hands to wither in the name of Jesus. I command the hands to wither in the name of Jesus. The Bible said, why mess left? The enemies came to plant. They plant with their hands. It is the hands they plant. Oh, beloved, we can't be true with this message today. This is going to be the part one. I'm going to come up with a part two tomorrow by the grace of God. 11 a.m. and it's going to be at night. Tomorrow, Sunday, is going to be 11, sorry, 11 p.m. At night, it's going to be the part two of this teaching. I'm coming with more revelation. More revelation. Jesus said, Why mess let the enemies? They came to sow tears among the wheat and they went their way. It takes the hand to plant, it takes the hand to deposit, it takes the hands to steal for whatever they've deposited that God has not deposited. Ah, is it whatever tree my father has not planted? Is going to be uprooted. Whatever the enemies have deposited, I command them to be uprooted by fire. In the name of Jesus, whatever the enemies have planted, I command them to be uprooted. In the name of Jesus, anything the enemies have planted in your hands, planted in your life, planted in your marriage, that is not planted by God, by the power in the blood of Jesus, they are uprooted. They are uprooted. They are uprooted. They are uprooted. Every evil plantation that the enemy is planted into your hands, planted into your labor, planted into your womb, be uprooted by fire, planted into your blood. As you are saying, Amen, they are uprooted. They are uprooted. They are uprooted. They are uprooted. In the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. Begin to share. Begin to invite friends. Begin to invite friends. Joy. God bless you. Begin to share and invite friends right now. Begin to share. You belong to a lot of platform platforms. Go there and share right now. Go there and share right now. Go there and share right now. Yes. Whatever it is that the enemies have planted in your life that God has not planted. They did not just plant it in your life. They planted in the lives of your mother's children. But they, they concentrated in you alone. Because they know what you will become if they do not bombard you, if they do not attack you. They know that if they give you space, you will shine. Therefore, I pronounce upon your life, arise and shine. 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 Jacob cursed Reuben. Moses reversed it. Moses command the cause to be broken. Therefore, I pray for you every cause that have been militating against your hands, every cause against your hands, I command the cause to be broken. Be broken. Be broken. Be broken. Be broken. Be broken. In the name of Jesus, every cause that says with your hands you will scatter your home, every cause that says with your hands you will fall into trouble, the cause is broken. In the name of Jesus, it's hands for hands, hands for hands. What they took from you, they are bringing it back. With their hands, they took it. Whatever they planted with their hands, why mess left, they came to plant. You did not give them invitation. You never invited them. They came on their own to make life unbearable for you, to make you go through life in pain, to make sure you don't fulfill your destiny, to make sure you don't become what God wants you to be because that is the agenda of the wicked. That is the agenda of our soul enemy so that you will not become what God wants you to be. The Bible said, the son of man go as it is written of him. Every child of God, it is written of us by God to prosper. And that's why I said, I know the thought I think towards you, they are not of evil, but they are of good to give you peace and prosperity. To give you peace and prosperity. To give you peace and prosperity. Where there is peace, progress is there. Progress is the mother of prosperity. And therefore, every antagonism, every attack against your peace, I command that power to die. Any power that have taken your peace, they stole it away. They shall return it. 
with pure enduring for a night, joy coming in the morning. Therefore, this morning I prophesy upon your life, upon the life of your husband, upon the life of your children, upon the life of your mother's children. Receive peace, receive peace, receive peace, receive peace. Peace be unto you, 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 in the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. They came, they planted, and the Bible said they went their ways. The enemy came, they planted things, and they went their ways. I don't know whatever they have given to you. They've given you a basket. They place basket upon your hands. And that is why you walk nothing to show for it. Nobody goes to the stream with a basket and expect it to come back with water. No, no, no. It's not possible. And that is what the devil has done to so many people. They fasten the whole basket to their hands. And no matter, no matter they dip in, no matter they try to get the water, they, shall, they are returning empty. In the beginning, the Bible said it was not so. An enemy has done this. An enemy is not a stranger. An enemy is not a stranger. Whoever that lay your hands against your womb, whoever that is suffocating the fetus, whoever that is, that is hijacking the semen off your, off your, your womb, whenever you meet with your husband, every hand diverting it, that you will not become pregnant, I command that hands, wither by fire, 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 except you were not giving birth by a woman, except your mother did not give birth to you, but if you were giving birth by your mother, I declare upon your life today, let the yoke of barrenness is broken. The yoke of barrenness is broken. Spirit husband inhabiting your womb. Making it impossible. Swallowing whatever that comes in there. Enough is enough. Today be evacuated by fire. I challenge your womb. I challenge your womb. I challenge your spirit. I challenge your soul. I challenge your body. With the fire of the Holy Ghost. With the fire of the Holy Ghost. Whatever God has not planted in that body. Be evacuated. Be evacuated. Be flushed out. 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 In the name of Jesus. Do you know it is with the hand. People place evil mark. Therefore every hand that is placing evil mark upon your life. I command that hand to wither. I command that hand to be cut off. I command that hand to be cut off. Whether it's from the family compound. Whether it's from the village. Whether it is the hand of a friendly friend. Placing evil mark upon you. Responsible for hatred and rejection. It takes an evil mark for people to be hated. To be rejected. Therefore every hand that is placing evil mark upon you. That hand shall wither. That hand shall wither. The hands also can scatter. So people gather. Before you know it's scattered. And yet the same people will ask, I thought you were working. What have you achieved? What has become of you? Enough of that nonsense. Enough of that insult. Enough of that humiliation. Enough of that torment. Every hands that is taken from you and replacing with bad things. Taking progress from you. Giving you disappointment. Every hand that is taking celebration off your hands and giving you sympathy. Today I command the hands whatever they have stolen. To return it and cast fire. To return it and wither. To return it and wither. To return it and wither. In the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. Whatever the enemies have stolen from you, they are going to return it. It is hands for hands. They've taken your peace, they will bring it back. They've taken your joy, it is, it is restored. Whatever the enemies have taken from you, it shall be restored. In the name of Jesus. Peter told Jesus in the book of Luke chapter 5, that you, listen to me sir, I've here, I've told all night. Toiling is that is a mark of struggling. Toiling is a word that represents suffering and smiling. Toiling is a word that says suffer till you die. And that is the work of the wicked. That is the agenda of the enemy. That is the agenda of polygamous wickedness. That is the agenda of the evil powers of the father's house. The idol power of the father's house. The idol you refuse to serve, but they said, wherever you go, they will follow you. You left the village, you left the family compound, but they are following you. They bent on making things not to work for you. They set missionary in motion to see that if every, any good thing that wants to come into your hands, they are aware. They are aware for the purpose to abort it. They use your dream to manipulate good things off your life. They use your dream to take good things off your hands. Today, enough is enough. That nonsense must stop. That insult must stop. That torment, that humiliation must stop. In the name of Jesus. And that is why you see a lot of people 
powers appear here to them in their dream take money off their hands they use familiar faces to take money from you in your dream it is the hand of the devil it is the hand of the wicked they don't want you to prosper he takes the hands to prosper because your hands it's your symbol of prosperity Therefore, I pray for you. With your hands, you will be congratulated. You will receive a congratulatory handshake. That your letter is out. That your document out, is out. That the visa is out. That your wife has put to bed in the name of Jesus. They will say, congratulations. Congratulations. Now you are pregnant. The fibroid is no longer there. Congratulations. Congratulations. I receive your wedding card. I, I will be there. Congratulations. Congratulations. With the hands, people are congratulated. It is hands for hands today. So whatever the enemies have stolen, they are going to return it back. Whatever the enemies have stolen from you, they are bringing it back to you. They are bringing it back to you. They are bringing it back to you. The Bible says whatever they've stolen is not going to come back the same way. It's coming back with interest. So I've asked myself, where is the other? Uh, where are they get, going to get the interest from? And it's not my business because the word of God says they're going to bring it back with interest. They are going to add to whatever they've stolen. They are going to add to it. Sevenfold, the Bible says. So your doors is going to be seven multiple doors. You are going to receive double promotion. For the delay in your conception, God is going to give you triplet. In the name of Jesus. For the delay concerning your marriage, God is going to give you a man that beats your your desire far beyond your desire if you need a good man god will give you a better man you need a a better man god will give you the best he can give to you it's going to be compensation what they've stolen why men slept the enemy came and plant and what they plant is permitted to grow and when it grows it's going to be at harvest and it takes the hand to harvest therefore i pray for you if the enemies have done it, that your hands are their vesting failure, today your hands will not have vest failure anymore. In the name of Jesus. If your hands are their vesting disappointment, enough is enough. I speak into your hands right now. Those hands refuse to have disappointment. I speak into your hands now. You, the hands of those watching right now, wherever they are, all over the world, refuse to obey the instruction of the enemies. You will not have vest failure. Your hands will not have disappointment. Your hands will not have rejection. Your hands will not have scarcity. In the name of Jesus, your hands will not have trouble. Your hands will not have miscarriage. In the name of Jesus, what the enemy is planted, it is a seed and it is bound to grow. And when, it, when, it, when it's grown up, it, it's going to be for harvest. You are not going to have what you did not plant. Whatever a man so shall you reap. Therefore, every evil hands from home that has been planting disappointment in your life, they shall avert whatever they have planted. They shall get whatever they have done against you. In the name of Jesus, they want you to be one spot. The cause is broken. In the name of Jesus, anything done against your hands, making life unstable for you, making things difficult for you, it is destroyed. 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 In the name of Jesus, the hand of the wicked is holding a rod. It is called the rod of the wicked. With that rod, they scatter. With that rod, they dismantle. Every rod of the wicked laid upon your hands, laid upon the hands of your mother's children, particularly you, because they are aware that if they let you go, you are going to be a wonder. The enemies, they shall labor in vain. Concerning your case, I pray for you, just as the Lord did not rest until the children of Israel got to the promised land, until they got to the land that flew with Micah honey. He chased the enemies out of the way. For their sake, he, he do not suffer any man to do them no evil. He take up king for their sake, and the mountains saw them, the mountains keep and, and fled. The hill saw them, and the hill, you know, developed legs and began to run. Clear of the way. He did not rest until they got to the land that flew with Micah honey. I pray for you concerning your marriage, concerning your conception, concerning that document, concerning your mother's children. Heaven will not rest on your case. Heaven will not rest on your matter until you become that which God wants you to be. The agenda of the enemies will not prosper in your life. The enemies shall labor in vain. Concerning your children, concerning your destiny, concerning your business, concerning your career, concerning your education, the enemies shall labor in vain. In the name of Jesus. We are going to pray 21 prayers quickly. 
and wherever you are, I want you to join in the prayers. I want you to join in the prayers. I want you to join in the prayers. You begin to repeat the prayers as I as I say the prayers. You begin to repeat the prayers before me. Begin to repeat the prayers before me. Begin to repeat the prayers before me. Any prayer that is issued, begin to grasp it, begin to repeat it, and then testimonies will break forth in your life. Every acidic cause making money not to meet money in my hands be broken in the name of Jesus. Open your mouth and begin to pray that prayer. That is the number one. Every acidic cause making money not to meet money in my hands be broken, be broken, be broken, be broken. Every acidic cause targeted to make money not to meet money in your hands, make money not to meet money in the hands of your husband. By the power in the blood of Jesus, be broken now. 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 In the name of Jesus, every acidic cause making money not to meet money in your hands, be broken. Be broken. Be broken. Open your mouth and begin to pray that prayer. I pray for you today. Every acidic causes making money not to meet money in your hands by the power in the blood of Jesus, that cause is broken. That cause is broken. That curse is broken. That curse is broken. That curse is broken. In the name of Jesus. Begin to share. Begin to share this broadcast wherever you are joining us from. Begin to share. You belong to a lot of groups in the, in the you know, on the social media. Begin to share this broadcast to endeavor others to be blessed. In the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. Number two prayer. Evil powers of my father's house. Swallowing my goodness. Swallowing my testimonies. Swallowing my blessings, vomit and die in the name of Jesus. Any evil power of your father's house swallowing the good things that have come into your hands. I command that power to vomit them and die in the name of Jesus. Any evil power from your father's house swallowing your testimonies, vomit, die, vomit, die, vomit, die, vomit, die, vomit, die, vomit, die. In the name of Jesus, I speak into your hands. Receive deliverance, receive deliverance, receive deliverance, receive deliverance, receive deliverance, receive deliverance. Somebody you are watching, your hand is on fire, your hand is on fire, your hand is on fire. The chains of the enemies are broken, the fetter, the shackles, they are broken, 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 they are broken. Evil parts of your father's house that is swallowing good things in your hands, swallowing good things in your life. Today, I command that power, vomit the blessings and die. 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 In the name of Jesus, that is the number two prayer. Open your mouth and pray that prayer wherever you are. Evil parts of my father's house that has been swallowing good things in my life. That has been swallowing, that has that swallowed my marriage certificate. Vomit it and die. That has swallowed my congratulation. That has swallowed my celebration. That has swallowed my blessings. Vomit and die. Vomit and die. Vomit and die. That has swallowed my promotion. You are a liar. Vomit and die. I shall be promoted. I shall excel. In the name of Jesus. Open your mouth and begin to decree. 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 In the name of Jesus. Number three prayer. Every hand that is closing my financial door be paralyzed. In the name of Jesus. Any evil hands that has been closing your financial door be paralyzed. I command every closed doors financially open by fire. 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 For you, open by fire. For your husband, open by fire. For your children, open by fire. For your helpers, open by fire. Open by fire. Open by fire. In the name of Jesus, every evil hands that has been shutting your door spiritually, the door of your finance, the door of your prosperity, the door of your increase. Today, I command the hands wither by fire. 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 In the name of Jesus. That is the number three prayer. That is the third prayer. That is the third prayer. Every evil hands that has been closing the door of your finance, the door of financial breakthrough, I command the hands wither. 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 Wither by fire. In the name of Jesus. Therefore, I now command every closed doors, open now, open now, open now, open now, open now, open now, open now. Closed doors, open now. Financial closed doors, open now. Financial closed doors, open now. In the name of Jesus. This is the number four prayer. There are 21 prayers. 
This is number four prayer. Every hand holding my peace, release by fire. In the name of Jesus. So put your mouth and begin to pray. I pray for you. Every evil hand that is holding your peace, return it by fire. 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 Your peace is restored this morning. 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 In your office, your peace is restored. In your place where you are getting your daily bread, I command your peace to be restored. In the name of Jesus, I command your peace to be restored. Power sitting upon your peace, be unseated. And die, be unseated. And die, your peace be restored. Your marital peace is restored. Your marital peace is restored. Your peace is restored. Every hand that has stolen your peace, that has hijacked your peace, return it by fire, return it by fire, return it by fire, return it by fire, return it by fire. In the name of Jesus. And this is number four prayer. This is number four prayer. Every evil hand scattering what you are gathering. Every evil hand scattering what I'm gathering. Whenever I gather problem will come to scatter the resources. Enough is enough. I command that hand to be cut off. In the name of Jesus, that is the number five prayer. Every evil hand that is that is scattering what you are gathering, I command that hands to be cut off. In the name of Jesus, witchcraft hands scattering what you are gathering. I command that hands right now to be cut off, to be cut off, to be cut off, to be cut off. Evil hands, evil hands, evil hands from the north, from the south, from the west. I don't care who owes the hands that has been scattering what I'm gathering. Enough is enough. I cut you off now. I cut you off now. I cut you off. I cut you off. In the name of Jesus, every evil hands you know, that has been scattering what I'm gathering, I cut you off. I cut you off. I cut you off. Open your mouth and pray that prayer for yourself. In the name that is above every other name. In Jesus' mighty name, we pray. Number six prayer. Number six prayer. Every cauldron of darkness. Every cauldron of darkness. Cooking my hands spiritually. Be broken in the name of Jesus. That is why so many hands cannot hold. That is why so many hands cannot prosper. Their hands are being cooked spiritually. The enemies have hijacked their hands. Every evil hands cook every evil cauldron, every evil pot. Cooking anything representing your hands in the realm of the spirit be broken. Be broken. Let that cauldron scatter. Let that cauldron be broken. In the name of Jesus, let the cauldron of darkness that is cooking anything that is representing your labor, representing your finance, representing your prosperity, be broken, be destroyed. Scatter by fire. Scatter by fire. In the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. Number seven. Any evil hand spending your money before you receive it. It is possible. Some money, some wealth has been spent. Some prosperity has been spent before the, the, the rightful owner received them. And therefore, that is why they cannot account for it. No matter where they are working. They've been diaspora for so many years. Nothing to show for it. They left their fathers as for the city. Others that just left yesterday, they build houses, they have achievement. There's something they can show for their, for their sweat and for their labor. But theirs, it is practically impossible. Nothing to show. I pray for you. That is number, that is number seven prayer. That is number seven prayer. Any evil hand spending my money before I receive it, be destroyed by fire. In the name of Jesus, open your mouth and begin to pray. Any evil hand spending your money before you receive it, receive destruction. 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 In the name of Jesus, every evil hands under the sun, every evil hands from the water, every hands from the coven, Ah, that is spending your money before you get it so that you will not have anything to show for the soul for your for your sweat for your labor i command our hands to wither i command our hands to wither i command our hands to wither open your mouth and begin to pray that prayer power spending my money before i receive it i command that power to die i command our hands to wither i command our hands to wither in the name of jesus oh god arise that's number eight. Oh god arise the hands that are meant to bless me let them show up in the name of Jesus. The hands that are meant to bless me, let them show up. Every hands that are meant to bless you, the hands that are meant to promote you, the hands that are meant to, to do that which you have been desiring, let that hands appear. Let that hands show up. In the name of Jesus, the hands that are meant to bless you, where are you? Appear by fire. Appear by fire. And bless me now. And bless me now. That is the prayer you are going to begin to pray. That is number eight prayer. Every hands that are meant to bless me, wherever you are, show up. Wherever you are, show up. 
wherever you are, show up. Every hands that are meant to bless you, I command the hands to show up. I command the hands to show up. I command the hands to show up. From the north, show up. From the south, show up. From the east, show up. From the west, show up. Every hands that are meant to bless you today. Every hands that are meant to bless you in the new week. Every hands that are meant to bless you in the month of April. Every hands that are meant to bless you in 2019. I command those hands now to release your blessings. I command those hands appear, release the blessings. 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 Open your mouth and begin to pray that prayer. Begin to pray that prayer. Begin to pray that prayer. In the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. That, that is number nine. In Jesus' mighty name, we pray. Number nine, prayer. Number nine, prayer. Number nine, prayer. Every evil chain upon my hands be broken, be dismantled. In the name of Jesus, every chain that follow me from home upon my hands, break, break, break. Break in the name of Jesus. That is number nine prayer. I open your mouth and begin to pray. Every evil chains upon my hands, every evil chains upon my marriage, every evil chains upon my, my, my the, the hands of my children, every evil chains upon the hands of my husband be broken. You, the hands that follow me from family compound, you are a liar, you are a failure. You can't stop me. Enough is enough. Break by fire, break by fire, break by fire, break by fire. Big by fire is in already he has broken the gate of brass. Therefore, every evil chains upon my hands, preventing me from grabbing what I supposed to grab, preventing me from prospering. Today, let that evil chains be broken. Chains of darkness be broken. Inherited evil chains be broken. Ancestral chains be broken. Chains of the spirit, wife, spirit, husband upon your hands be broken. Marine chains be broken. Be broken, be broken, be broken, be broken. Chains of family, strong man, be broken. Chains of familiar spirit, be broken. Chains of ancestral spirit, be broken, be broken. Every chain of darkness upon your hands. Chains of the night, chains put upon your hands by the Lord of the night, by witchcraft spirit that claim to be the Lord of the night. Every chain that placed upon you from the coven, break now, 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 break now. In the name of Jesus, the chains are broken. The chains are broken. The chains are broken. In Jesus' mighty name, we pray. We are still going to pray. Number 10 now. Every witchcraft hands are vesting my testimonies. Release it and die. In the name of Jesus, every witchcraft hands are vesting my testimony. Release and wither. Release and wither. Release and wither. Release and die. Witchcraft hands are vesting my testimony. Release and wither. Release and wither. Release and wither. Every witchcraft hands, wherever you are, I'm not interested. Every witchcraft hands that is meditating against your finance, against your breakthrough, I command our hands to wither, 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 wither by fire. Wither by fire. That is number 10. Every witchcraft hands taken from me, wither by fire. Wither by fire. Wither by fire. Wither by fire. In the name of Jesus. In Jesus' name we pray. Number 11. Number 11. Number 11. Any evil hand from home taken from me and keep it inside the meeting pot, cast fire. In the name of Jesus, every evil hands from home taking blessings from you, keeping inside evil pot, cast fire, cast fire, cast fire, cast fire. In the name of Jesus, every evil hands from home taken from you, keeping inside the pot, covering the native pot. Today, let the hands wither, let the pot break, let the hands wither, let the pot break, let the hands wither, let the pot break, let the hands wither, let the pot break. Let the hands wither. Let the pot break. In the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. Begin to share this broadcast. Those of you that are just joining us now. Wherever you are joining, begin to share the broadcast. In the name of Jesus. That is number 11. Let the hands wither. In Jesus' mighty name we pray. Number 12. Evil hands. Evil hands. Stealing my blessings through my dreams. Enough is enough. I cut you off. In the name of Jesus, every evil hand stealing your blessings through your dream, be cut off. Every evil hand attacking your destiny through your dreams, be cut off. Be cut off. Be cut off. That is the number 12 prayer. Open your mouth and begin to pray it now. Every evil hand that is stealing from you through your dreams, be cut off. 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 Every evil hand be delay your conception through your dreams, be cut off. Be cut off. Be cut off. Every evil hands oppressing you at the hours of the night, be cut off. 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 Witchcraft hands, occultic hands, marine hands, the hands of the ancestral idol that is stealing from you in your dream. 
Let the hands be cut off now. Be cut off now. Be cut off now. Open your mouth and pray that prayer. Pray that prayer. Pray that prayer. In Jesus' mighty name, we pray. In Jesus' mighty name, we pray. In Jesus' mighty name, we pray. This is the thirteenth prayer. The thirteenth prayer. Every evil hands, I jack in my testimony at the point of entry. About to enter into your hands, you take it. You saw it coming, but it never manifested. You almost got the employment, you almost got the job. It, it will never come. Almost become a mother. You missed your period, but it never manifested. There's an evil hand that is if there's an evil hand somewhere, somewhere that is behind it. And therefore, this morning, that is number 13 prayer. Every evil hands. I jacking my testimony up my hands, taking it up my hands, arresting my testimonies, arresting my blessings, my promotion, my employment at the point of entry today we wither by fire. Open your mouth and begin to pray that prayer. I command every evil hands, every evil hands. That is number 13. Every evil hands. I jacking my blessings. I jacking my testimonies. At the point of entry, I cut you off. I cut you off. I cut you off. Wither. 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 I cost you to wither. I cost you to wither. I cost you to wither. Every evil hands. Every evil hands. Every evil hands. Every evil hands wither by fire. Evil hands that has been hijacking your testimony at the point of entry. At the point of entry to your hands, wither by fire. Open your mouth and pray that prayer in anger. Pray that prayer in anger. In the name of Jesus, every evil hands that is hijacking your testimonies at the point of entry. In the name of Jesus, wither by fire. Wither by fire. Wither by fire. There are some people, testimonies about to enter their hand. Very, very close. Almost there, but never getting it. It is the work of the devil. Enough is enough. I command it now to wither. 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 I command our hands to wither. In the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. Please share this broadcast wherever you are joining us from. We are still in the mood of prayer. It is hands for hands. Whatever the enemies have stolen from you, taken from your hands, they are going to return it. Whatever the enemies have taken from you, they are returning it. Their hands took it, their hands will bring it. Their hands planted it, their hands will come and uproot it. Because whatever a man sowed, shall he reap. That is what the Bible says. They sow that evil seed, they will grab it back. They've sowed the seed of this corner in your home, that will be their portion. Those that planted disunity, that will be their portion. Those that planted sickness in your life, that will be their portion. Those that planted failure, they shall fail and you shall succeed. In the name of Jesus. You know why? The Bible says, Who said a thing and it coming to pass when God has not commanded it? That is not the will of God concerning your life. Whatever the enemies have done against you, we undo them. We unturn them. We abort them. We reverse them. We revoke them. In the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. We are going to pray again. It is with, with your hands you receive favor. Say, my hands, my hands, hear ye the word of the Lord. Receive your testimony. In the name of Jesus, open your mouth and speak that into your hands. My hands, my hands, my hands. Hear ye the word of the Lord. Receive favor. Receive testimony. Receive favor. Receive testimonies. That is the number 14th prayer. You, my hands, my hands, my hands. Hear ye the word of the Lord. Receive favor. Receive breakthrough. Receive testimony. Receive promotion. Receive employment. In the name of Jesus, receive miraculous conception. My hands, my hands, my hands. That is number 14 prayer. My hands, my hands, my hands. My hands, my hands, my hands. Receive favor. Receive testimony. Receive breakthrough. In the name of Jesus, today, receive it. Today, receive it. This week, receive it. This month, receive it. Receive it. Receive it. In the name of Jesus, I speak into your hands. Receive favor. From where you do not put your mind, receive favor. From where you least expect it, receive testimonies. In the name of Jesus. In Jesus' name we pray. Number 15 prayer. Number 15 prayer. We are going to decree number 15. I decree by the decree of heaven. By this time tomorrow, my hands, you will grab testimony. You will grab favor. In the name of Jesus, open your mouth and begin to pray. I decree by the decree of heaven. By this time tomorrow, my hands, you will grab favor. My hands, you will grab favor. My hands, you will grab blessings. In the name of Jesus, I decree by the decree of heaven. By this time tomorrow, my hands will receive favor. My hands will receive blessing. My hands will receive favor. That is number 15 prayer. That is the 15th prayer. By this time tomorrow, my hands will grab favor. You will grab testimonies. You will grab breakthrough. You will receive your long awaited favor. You will receive your long awaited desires. In the name of Jesus, 
my hands hear the word of the Lord by this time tomorrow, you will be a candidate of testimony, you will be a candidate of favor. Receive it now, receive it now, receive it now. In Jesus' mighty name, we pray. You are praying number 16. Every evil hand standing between you and your testimony, cash fire. In the name of Jesus, every evil hand standing between you, preventing good things from entering into your hands, cash fire, cash fire. Evil hands from home, cash fire. Evil hands of the idol of your father's house, cash fire, cash fire. The hands of familiar spirit, cash fire. The hands of witchcraft, cash fire. Married hands, cash fire. The hands of spirit husband, spirit wife that has been standing between you and your next level and your promotion and your achievement and your testimonies, cash fire, 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 cash fire. In the name of Jesus. In Jesus' mighty name we pray. Number 17th prayer. Every curse making me unstable in my labor be, be broken. In the name of Jesus, every curse making me unstable in whatever I lay my hands to do, break now. In the name of Jesus, open your mouth and begin to pray. Every curse, prayer number 17, every curse making me unstable, whatever I lay my hands to do, be broken, be broken, be broken, be broken, be broken. Be broken. Every curse that is making relationship unstable, let that curse be broken now. Let that curse be broken now. Every curse making you to be unstable in your labor, in that office, break by fire, 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 in the name of Jesus. Every cause making you unstable in your labor. That is number 17. Every cause making you unstable in your labor. Be broken now. Be broken now. Be broken now. Every curse making good things unstable in your hands, break by fire, 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 in the name of Jesus. Number 18. Number 18. Number 18. Every evil prophecy that says I shall labor in vain, you are a liar, you will not prosper. Back to sender. Expire now in the name of Jesus, every evil prophecy that say I will labor in vain in my marriage, in my ministry, in my calling, expire, backfire. In the name of Jesus, open your mouth and pray that, that every evil prophecy that say you shall labor in vain with your hands today, your hands receive deliverance. Your hands receive deliverance. I command that evil prophecy backfire, 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 backfire. Evil prophecies from your father's house, evil prophecies by unfriendly friend, evil prophecies of the past waiting to manifest in your marriage, in your finance, in your labor, expire, expire. They will wait forever. That evil prophecy will not will not work. It will not prosper. Evil prophecies ever released that you shall not labor in vain. Evil prophecies that say you shall not prosper. I command that evil prophecy to expire, to expire. Evil prophecy making life tough and hard for your husband, making you to toil in life. Today, I command that evil prophecy be destroyed, be destroyed, be destroyed, be destroyed, be destroyed, be destroyed. Be destroyed. In the name of Jesus, who said a thing and the coming to pass when God has not commanded it? Every evil prophecy that says you shall labor in vain, I command that evil prophecy to expire. You shall not labor in vain. You shall not labor in vain. As you are saying amen, you shall not labor in vain. Your heaven is opening. Your heaven is opening. As you say amen, your heaven is opening. I command your heavens to open. I command your heavens to open. I command your heavens to open. You shall not labor in vain. Every evil prophecy that says you will labor in vain. In your marriage, in the lives of your children, today that evil prophecy expire. That evil prophecy expire. That evil prophecy expire. In the name of Jesus. I pray for you, you shall not labor in vain. In Jesus' mighty name, we pray. Number 19 prayer. There are 21. Anything buried or done under the sun to cripple my finance, to cripple whatever I lay my hands to do, today, die. In the name of Jesus, anything done under the sun to cripple your finance, to cripple whatever you lay your hands to do, die by fire. 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 That is prayer point number 19. That is prayer number 19. Whatever has been done under the sun, whatever has been buried under the sun,
to bury whatever you lay your hands to do, to bury your prosperity. Today, expire. Today, be destroyed. Today, expire. Today, be destroyed. In the name of Jesus, anything done under the sun to cripple your finance, to cripple your marriage, to make sure that whatever you lay your hands to do, you will not prosper. Expire, 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 expire. In the name of Jesus, anything done under the sun to keep good things in your life, to cripple your peace, to cripple your joy, to cripple your labor, to cripple your finance, to cripple your pregnancy, today, to cripple your marriage, to cripple your relationship, to cripple your connection, to cripple your heart desire. Today, anything buried down under the sun to bring evil to you, expire by fire, expire by fire, expire by fire, expire by fire, expire by fire. In the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. Number 20. Every invisible task collector, ancestral task collector, witchcraft task collector, marine task collector, attached to your hands, attached to your hands, attached to your hands, attached to the hands of your husband, attached to the hands of your wife, attached to your family, that every good thing that comes, they are jack. Every good thing that comes, they steal. Today, today, you that taskmaster, commit suicide. Rush to the grave. Commit suicide. Rush to the grave. Commit suicide. Rush to the grave. In the name of Jesus, wherever you are, I pray for that man, I pray for that woman, I pray for that boy, I pray for that girl. I pray for your mother's children. I pray for your husband. I pray for your wife. I pray for your helpers. Every invisible task collector, every witchcraft task collector, you that strong man, that is a task collector, whatever good things comes into the hands, you are jack. Money comes, you are jack. Peace comes, you are jack. Enough is enough. It is time to die. Die by fire. 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 I sentence you now. I sentence you now. Invisible task collector that follow you from the village. That follow you from a father's house to diaspora. That follow you from the village to the city. That is making sure that every good thing that comes into your hand, they are collecting it from you. That invisible task master that has been glued to your hands. Lose your hold and die. 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 Enough is enough. I curse you today. I curse you today. You that invisible strong man. You that witchcraft task collector. Attached to their hands, scattering what comes into your hands. Enough is enough. Die by fire. Lose your hold and die. 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 In the name of Jesus. Please share this broker. Somebody is going to be blessed. That is the twentieth prayer. Every invisible tax collector, every invisible tax master attached to your hands from home, from the village, follow you to the city, follow you to oversee, follow you to that place of work, follow you to your new location. Today, cost be them. Woe unto them. In the name of Jesus, open your mouth and begin to pray that prayer for yourself. Every invisible tax collector that says, My hand will not rest. Enough is enough. You have done enough. It is time to die. Die by fire. Die by fire. I curse you now. You that invisible tax master. Attached to the destiny of those that are watching. Wherever you are under the sun. Attached to your life. I command that tax master. Lose your hold and die. 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 In the name of Jesus. 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 We're going to pray 2021 now. We're going to pray 2021. Bewitchment upon my labor. Your hands is symbol of your your hands is symbol of your labor, symbol of your prosperity. Bewitchment upon my labor. Bewitchment upon my prosperity. Da. In the name of Jesus, pray that prayer violently. Pray that prayer violently. In the name of Jesus, every witchcraft bewitchment upon my hands, upon my career, upon my certificate, upon my destiny. Da, 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 da. You have done enough every witchcraft bewitchment. Every bewitchment from home. Every bewitchment from my father's house. Every bewitchment from my mother's house. From where I got married. Against my destiny. Every witchcraft bewitchment. Against my labor. Against my hands. Da, 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 da. In the name of Jesus. Every witchcraft bewitchment. Be terminated. Witchcraft bewitchment. Against my womb. Be terminated. Against your certificate. Be terminated. Against your health. 
be terminated. Against your next level, be terminated. Every witchcraft bewitchment. Against your promotion, be terminated now. Against your relationship, be terminated. Bewitchment, da, 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 da. In Jesus' mighty name we pray. Amen. Finally, finally, finally. Power to prosper. Power of the highest. Fall upon my life. Fall upon my hands. Power to prosper. Power of the highest. Fall upon my hands. In the name of Jesus, beginning from now, whatever I lay my hands to do, I shall prosper. Power of the highest. I prophesy. I decree with my mouth open. And as I open my mouth, let my heavens open. Power to prosper. Fall upon my hands. That is the last prayer. 21. 21. Prayer to crush. Anti prosperity power. The last prayer. Power to prosper. Power of the highest. Envelope my hands. Fall upon my hands. Locate my hands. Hit my hand now. Power to prosper. Power to gather. Power to excel. Power to achieve. Power to hold. Power to become what I want to become. Fall upon my hands in the name of Jesus. Power to prosper. Power of the to, of the highest. Fall upon my hands. Open your mouth and begin to pray in the name of Jesus. Power of the highest. Fall upon my hands. Power to gather. Fall upon my hands in the name of Jesus. Therefore, beginning from now, your hands shall prosper. Your hands shall prosper. You will gather. You will enjoy. You will gather. You will enjoy. You will lay your hands upon something. It will not slip off. You will hold it. You will have more and more. You will hold. You will hold. In the name of Jesus. Power behind get and lose be broken. Beginning from now, whatever I lay my hands to do, I shall prosper. Whatever I lay my hands to do, I shall prosper. Whatever I lay my hands to do, I shall excel. Whatever I lay my hands to do, I shall excel. In the name of Jesus, power to prosper, fall upon my hands. Power to prosper, fall upon my hands. Power to prosper, fall upon my hands. Open your mouth and decree that. Power to excel. Power to be congratulated, fall upon my hands. Power to hold my marriage certificate, fall upon my hands. Power to hold the best certificate of my child, fall upon my hands. Power to be pregnant, fall upon my hands. Power for safe delivery, fall upon my hands. Power to hold my blessing, fall upon my hands. Power to excel. Power to get a new job. Power to grasp my visa. Power to get to, uh, to receive my document. Power to receive the letter of promotion, fall upon my hands. Power to excel, fall upon my hands. Power to prosper, fall, 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 fall. In the name of Jesus, open your mouth and declare that upon yourself. And as you declare it, as you open your mouth, your heavens shall open. In the name of Jesus, this week we are entering this week. This month is your month. The month will not die, the month will not end until your testimony manifests. Tomorrow, by the grace of God, we are going to continue from where we start by 11 um, 11:30 also um, p.m. at night. It's going to be a night prayer. God bless you richly. You can still share if you are just joining, it doesn't matter. Keep sharing, or that will be blessed. God bless you. God bless you until we come your way again. Remain blessed in Jesus' name. God will prove himself in your life by the virtue of this prayer. He sent forth his word and he delivered them. The word of God carries solution. Every prayer that is backed by the word of God, it carries miracle. And it is your turn. This year shall be better. For all that you have lost, it shall be a year, your year of restoration. Because the anointing of ease, supernatural ease, is upon all of us. And it's a year of double honor. Receive it in the name of Jesus. God bless you. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen.